Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Bianca and today we're going to be doing another My Friend Designs My Makeup Look challenge. In a previous video that I did a couple weeks ago, I asked if y'all would like for me to do a couple more of these and I did get a few comments suggesting that you all enjoyed these videos. I'll link the first video up here in case you want to watch it. For today's video, we have my friend Julia who designed this makeup look. I'll put it right here and this makeup look has a few more parts to it. So what I want to do first is start off with the eyes. So for this look, she wants a white glitter eyeshadow with straighter brows and then a white slash black eyeliner look with an extended eyeliner kind of point here in the inner corner of the eyes. So that's where we're going to start off with and then once we complete the eyes we'll go on to the rest of the face. For now I just have some concealer and basic contour on my cheeks. Without any further ado, let's get started with the eyes. So I don't think I actually have just a basic white eyeshadow but I'm going to start off and go in with this silvery shadow. And then I also have this Disco Queen kind of white glitter eyeshadow from e.l.f. Cosmetics that I'll put on top of that. And what we're gonna do next is white and black eyeliner. It's a wing eyeliner with like a little, or I guess you could call it like a V-shaped winged eyeliner. And that part is gonna be in black. A couple dots of white eyeliner between the V and then a couple dots up here for white eyeliner and kind of like a cut crease white eyeliner on top. So we're gonna start off with the black and then we'll do the white afterwards. All right, so we have one eye done with the black eyeliner. Now let's see if I can recreate it on this side. The black eyeliner is complete. All right, and now we're gonna go in and make the white eyeliner. I'm gonna start off with the dots. So we have three white dots here, and then we have three dots within the V of the black eyeliner. All right, we have the dots. And lastly, for the eyeliner, we have that white kind of cut crease liner. All right, it looks like we are done with the eyeliner and eyeshadow portion of this look. I'm just gonna go ahead and add on some lashes and then we'll continue on with the look. A few moments later. All right, lashes are on. The next thing that she has in the eye area is a straighter brow. And I don't ever really do anything to my brows, so we'll see if I can make this work. I don't really have any brow pencils that I could use for this, so I'm just gonna use this little brush and and try to make my brows look a little straighter. I think this is as good as it's gonna get for the brows. Next on her look, we have the face. So she wants a bright blush with white clouds and then a button nose contour. We're gonna do that first. I'm gonna go in with my Rare Beauty contour stick. And now she wants a bright blush with white clouds. So I'm gonna go in with this blush and I'm just gonna put some like this. All right, so we have the blush. Next, she wants white clouds. We have completed the clouds for this look. We're gonna go on to the lips and she wants an ombre bitten lip kind of look with a clear gloss on top. This is a lipstick called Really Rose from Pixie by Petra. I also want to go in with a little bit of red and just make it a little bit darker. Okay, so we have that down. Now she just wants a clear gloss on top. And I'm just going in with this e.l.f. lip lacquer. And here is the final look. But wait, there's more. All right, Julia requested I wear something that fits the look, so she chose this beautiful little dress. I will show you what it looks like all together in just a moment. Um, she also added the option of doing curly hair. I would curl my hair, but unfortunately I washed my hair yesterday and I totally forgot I was gonna be filming this today, but otherwise I would have definitely curled my hair. But just imagine, I'll edit me with some curly hair. <laughs> 
<laughs> up here. And you can see the final look. But yeah, so I will go ahead and show you the dress that she picked out. And there you have it. That is the look for today. I think she did a great job with this look. It's not something I would typically do, but I really like the way that it came out, especially the clouds and the lips. But yeah, that's it for this video today. I hope you enjoy this little series of my friends designing my makeup. Please feel free to like and subscribe and leave a comment down below if you'd like to see more of these or if you'd like to be the one to design my makeup for the next video. I am reaching out to a couple of friends within the next few weeks to get the ball rolling and see if they'd want to participate. But I think this has been really fun and I love seeing what they come up with and how I'm recreating it on my own face. Hopefully we can continue doing this. It's quite the challenge but it's also very fun. I hope y'all enjoyed this makeup video and I will see y'all in the next one. Bye!